Hi, RepercussionLessons.com, talking about measuring rolls. Measuring the roll is taking the beat and dividing it evenly, either by sixteenth notes or triplets. Um, you can divide it in other ways, but let's talk about the basics first. So here's the beat. I'm going to divide that by sixteenth notes. That would be duple. Two or four would be duple. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one E and a two E and I'm going to play sixteenth notes like this. I'm going to continue to play sixteenth notes, but I'm going to let the sticks bounce. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a stop. So I'm always thinking of those sixteenth notes, but I'm letting the stick bounce. Now I can do the same in triple. Triola, 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 triola. Usually when you do a triplet, the tempo is faster. So I'm going to speed it up a little bit. Triola, 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 triola. So now it sounds more like a roll. So if your tempo is reasonably slow, you're going to, you're going to measure in sixteenth notes. If it's a little faster and you can't play a sixteenth notes fast enough, then you switch back to the triplets. But that's a way to keep track of the beat so you don't get lost in those long rolls and you know exactly where to stop when you're supposed to. So this is FreePercussionLessons.com talking about measuring of rolls. If you practice those exercises that I've written out in the lesson plan, you're going to be very good at it. So. We'll see you later.